Pokemon have released an exclusive additional kind of ETB for the launch of Pokemon 151, Scarlet and Violet. On first glance, this might look like a regular 151 EV, but if you look closer, a little bit closer, you can see right here, it's the Pokemon Center exclusive ETB. Now, what does that mean? I'm gonna show you in this video. Let's go. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you're all doing good. My name is Randolph. This is Randolph Pokemon and we're going to open this bad boy right here. Maybe a few of them and I'm going to show you what's inside and hopefully we can get some sick pulls from the new set as well. I've been enjoying this set so far. If you have as well, make sure you leave a comment down below. Let me know. But what is different in this set? I was a bit too excited opening this, so I've ripped this off already. But as you can see, we have 11 booster packs in this as well, instead of having the nine from the regular ETV. Usually the artwork and the packaging is different, but it's pretty much the same. This is the normal ETV and this is the Pokemon Center exclusive ETV. It's just got a Pokemon Center logo on it. That's it. Usually the design's a little bit different but we do get more packs 11 like i said the rest of it's the same like a little bit of a different dice little little different counters and stuff but the card the promo card is different and i'll show you why right now there they are the beautiful packs but the promo card as you can see has a pokemon center logo which is a little bit different than the regular etv promo which is this one right here so this one's got a stamp a pokemon center stamp again not much difference, but it is a little bit better or it's a little bit different, you know. It adds a little bit of exclusivity there, so we like that. We take that. There's the code card. The rest is just the same, you know. I can't even remember if these are different, but it doesn't matter. Oh, hold on. You actually get two. Sorry, my bad. You get both the Pokemon Center and the regular ETV promos. So that's sick. Two promos in one. I'll take that. Don't mind if I diddly do. Not sure why I said that. But here we are, guys. Here's why you click the video to open the packs and see what we can pull from this set. Let's do this, guys. As always, we check if there's a hollow energy. There isn't in this pack. Then we get into it with the Pidgey, Metapod, Ponyta. Poliwag, Lapras, hashtag first pack look in the comments down below, guys. Let's do this. Scyther, Chomander Reverse Hollow. We have a Rhydon Reverse, Rhydon These Nuts, and a Jinx EX in our first pack. So more saying that the Jinx EX card is really playable this year, or they want to make a deck out of it. So that's kind of cool. If you're not already, guys, make sure you do subscribe to the channel. Leave a like on this video. We are back in the swing of things now. Oh, and look at that beautiful hollow energy. Let's go. Back into the pack, though. Yeah, I don't want to say it's a new era of Randolph Pokemon, but we are getting more content out there. So love that. Got things in place. Got people in place to help as well. So yeah, we're going to do this. Kadabra, Krabby. Oh my goodness me. Squirtle, rever oh, Reverse Hollow, Squirtle, Art Rare, should I say. And the final card is a Vile Plume Regular Hollow. But you know what? This ETV, this Pokemon Center ETV, has come out of the gate swinging. You know, we've got a pull already, got an Art Rare already, and an EX. I like this a lot. Hopefully, you guys have had a good luck in your 151 so far. I've been bringing out loads of videos of this, opening different kinds of boxes, different video concepts, and I'm really enjoying opening this. Still haven't pulled a God Pack as of right now, unless there's a video that has already come out showing you otherwise. But here we go. Machamp in the next pack as a regular holo. This feels good, though. This feels fun right now. A new set in English to shout about, to be excited about. It's a good time to be a Pokemon fan. Let me know what you guys are collecting at the minute. Are you grading? Are you collecting? Are you getting binders ready? What are you, what are you up to in Pokemon? Coughing. Diglett Reverse and A. Oh my goodness, that is what I like to see. Blastoise, full art. The texture, the shine on this is just stunning. Look at that, guys. Wow, wow, wow. Both Blastoise and Squirtle pulled in this opening so far. Can we get a Water Azul or can we get even more from this ETV? Look at that. Three cards pulled so far. Absolutely stunning. This is a good start. This is a very, very good start. And you know what? It only makes me excited to open even more of these packs. So let's get into it and let's get this moving. What a start to the video. If you haven't left a like yet, what are you doing? And look at that. A water hollow energy to go with the Blastoise, to go with the Squirtle, to go with the Jinx, actually. What? Bro, is this just a water type ETV Royale? <laughs> hey, I'm gassed. Okay, Slowpoke, Magmar, Horsey, more water, Abra, Cloyster. I used to love Qua Cloyster in Gen 1. I used to just love playing it with it in VGC as well. Really awful team, but oh, Reverse Hollow Cloyster, Speak of the Devil. We have a Venonat and then a Aerodactyl Hollow. So, you know, we can allow the packs to calm down just a little bit because it has been a crazy start, but wow. Wow, wow, wow. Grass Energy non hollow. Oddish, Mankey, Meowth, that's right. We got an Execute, Dugong, Hitmonchan, Seeking, Slowpoke, Ratatata. And a Mewtwo Hollow, or should I say hello? Still, I'm wishing they did the Master Balls in English, but it's okay. I got more Japanese to open. I really enjoy the Japanese set of this. It's such a good set. Fire Energy, non Hollow, Bulbasaur. But no, it's just 151. It's a great set, man. Gen 1, back to basics. Kanto, no one's going to complain. We've got a Ride on these Nuts. We've got Executor, Pidgeot, a Psyduck Reverse, and a Gyarados. Wow, Hollow. Nice. Okay, pulls are slowed down just a little bit. Just a slight bit. Hollow energy check. No. No bueno. Next pack starting with a Nidoran female. We've got a Ghastly, Parasment, Voltorb, what? Cycling Road, Scyther, Charmeleon, Victory Bell. 
Come on, give us something. Give us something. We have something. We have a Nido King art rare. That's what I'm talking about. On its throne, chilling on that rock. Enthusiastic King. Why, thank you. And the final card is a Marowak Hollow. Nido King, though, looking very, very royal. Again, okay, that corner's not great. Yeah, I know a lot of people have been saying that the condition's not been great on this set. That wouldn't get a 10 right there, unfortunately. The, the ace levels are looking really, really nice for this set as well. I'll say as much. Psychic energy. We got an Oddish. Mankey. Meowth, that's right. Execute, Seeking, Butterfree, Cycling Road, Hitmonchan, Reverse Hollow Dratini, and a Vaporeon. I wasn't really expecting anything in that pack because we have been spoiled in this ETV so far. What kind of look are you guys getting? Let me know in the comments. Is it good? Is it lucky? Is it not? I'd be really interested to see. Oh, it's beautiful. I love getting these hollow energies, man. So many swirls in them as well. I wish they can bring that hollow foil back, man. Just do it to us, Pokemon. Do it to us. Krabby, Sandshrew, Seal, Whoop, Doe Duo, Parasect, Giovanni's Charisma, Cloyster, Farfetched, okay, Cedra, and a Jolteon Hollow. And guys, we are into our final pack of this first ETV. Of course, I'm gonna open another one. I won't leave you guys with 11 packs in a video. <sighs> we can do more than that. Fighting Energy as the non hollow, Helix Fossil, Slowpoke, Magneton, Magmar, sorry, behind that. Nido Queen, Victory Bell. Come on, we got a Butterfree. Final pack. Let's do something big. We have a reversal on the arena. We could still get something though. A full art, a secret rare. Just another Marowak Hollow. It wasn't to be in that final pack. But guys, one second, I'll be back for more. Here we go. The second ETV. This is another Pokemon Center exclusive ETV. So again, eleven packs in here, and once more we have both promo cards: the Pokemon Center stamp and the regular as well, which is awesome. Love that. Here's a code card for this, guys. If you would like that. And let's get into our first pack of that second box. In the comments, guys, let me know. Do you think this ETV is gonna have better or? worse pulls than the first i'm gonna say it's gonna be even better okay i think we're gonna step it up from that blastoise um full art and i think we're gonna go crazy in this one a special illustrated rare or we riot or we open another etv okay that's the rules if we don't pull a special illustrated rare in this one right here we open one more to end up the video to try and get one of those rare special illustrated speaking of rare we've got a reverse hollow raichu right here in the end on the final card is a flareon hollow but don't worry we've got more in the tank more in the chamber and we're gonna prove it in this ETV. Hollow energy, love to see that. I'm making a pile of these energies, man. I'm keeping these, making a binder of them. Pikachu, Farfetch'd, Shelder, Helix Fossil, Snorlax, Sandslash, we have a Haunter, Pidgey, a Pidgeotto, a right, Pidgeot, Pidgeot, Dodrio. Wait, it's interesting because the Pidgeot actual, what is Pidgeot in this set? I actually can't remember. So I know in Obsidian Flame is the art rare, right? The special illustrated rare line of Pidgey. What's the regular Pidgeot in this? Is it a full art? Is it an EX? I don't even know. I'm gonna keep my eyes open now. Is it a regular rare? We've got a Fero. Kingler. Come on, come on. Ah, Clefable Reverse and a Gyarados. Hollow. Second ETV, a bit of a slow burner. You know, the first one was on fire. Fresh out the gate, it was giving us pulls. This second one is making us work for it a little bit. You know, we've got a Paris, Voltorb, Krabby, Sandshrew, Nidorino, Golduck, Pinsir, Nidoqueen, Rhydon. He's nuts. Oh, man. I didn't know the Nidoqueen was a reverse. Hello. I thought we had one extra card in that pack. Wow. Awful showing from his second ETV, man. Awful. Ooh, 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 ooh. <sighs> non hollow energy. I feel like the hollow energy is like a little good look, you know, symbol before the, before the pack. Squirtle. Licky Tongue getting some apples off the tree. Big Air Balloon, Primeape looking devilish. Fero, Machop, come on, come on. <sighs> Diglett and a Beedrill. Awful center on that one. Look at the bottom of the card. Thick. That Beedrill's thick. You know what? That's not even going to go to the Pokemon store. That's going to go into the trash because I'm not going to sell a card with centering like that. Pokemon.net, guys, as always, if you want to pick up your cards, H grade, if you want to grade your cards. Cheeky little plug. You got two of them right there. Pidgeotto. Come on, this is the pack. Old Amber, Magmar, come on, Shelder, Machoke, Dugong, Hitmonchan, Dodrio, Rare Reverse, <sighs> Venonat Reverse. And again, the Centurion. Man, I feel like so far, opening 151, I've been pretty lucky with the condition of most of the cards. But this ETV right here has let me down with the Centurion. And they're only hollows as well. But still, even the, even the Centurion on those aren't great, man. Not what you like to see. Hollow energy. We take that, though. Just look at that, guys. Look at that. Imagine pulling any hollow in this set with that pattern. It's just so much more appreciated and so much more nice. Pidgey, Poliwhirl, Kakuna, Onyx. We have a Dragonair, 
Cedra, Tentacool. Come on, come on. No, another reverse holo Ratatata. And a Marowak again as a holo. How many holo Marowaks have we pulled, man? Bro, this ETB's been dead. The first one was unreal. This one's been dead, man. We got four packs left in it, though. Hopefully, we can turn it around and get something major. If not, we're going to dip into another one. Another ETV, guys, for this video. Squirtle, Poliwag, Pidgeotto, Magmar. Even the central in these commons is not great. Uh, Lapras, Cycling Road, Scyther, Coughing, Doduo. And an Aerodactyl. Again with the bad Centurion, man. This might be the worst ETV I've opened, or the worst kind of 151 product I've opened so far. I've opened like the little booster collections that are better than this, man. And they have six packs in. This has nothing. Not even an EX. Just nothing but hollows. Magnemite, Caterpie, Eevee, Dome Fossil, Bill's Transfer, Golbat, Leftovers, Cloyster, Magmar, and a Mewtwo. Again, the Centurion. Okay, this is really bad. Low quality, man. Pokemon, you can do better than this, man. You guys can do better. Come on. This is not what I want to see. Not the pools. I'm talking about the Centurion, you know? <sighs> so nice, though. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on. Shelda. We want Erica. We want Charizard. Something big to take this uh, to the next level. Nidoran. Charmeleon. Parasect. Cloyster. Slowpoke. Tauros. That is just, that's like off center. It's not even like bad centering. That's just off center. I haven't thrown so many cards away in an opening ever, I don't think, you know? Wow. All right, final pack is ETV. At this stage, guys, I owe you another one, okay? I owe you another ETV. We're not we're not going to end this video like this. I'll open another one just for you guys. We've got Meowth, Clefairy, Seedra, Kabuto, Gloom. Oh, my goodness me. I'm all over the place right now. I'm all over the place. All right, come on. Eevee. Nah. Helix Fossil. Okay, there we go. Full arc, Giovanni's Charisma. That is what I'm talking about. At least we have something in this ETV. But it's not enough. To whet my appetite, I need more. The back, again, some scuffs on the bottom. The edge, the corner down here as well. The left corner too. But it's okay. We got the Giovanni Charisma. We got a full art. But don't go anywhere, guys. Another ETV is on its way. Actually, you know what? We're going to open one of these instead. Six packs in the booster collection. This was lucky for me last time. Instead of going into a whole other ETV, I'll just open one or two of these. There's still more packs than it would have been opening one ETV. I just want to see something. You know, I want to try and see if these little booster collections are the things to be buying. Okay. Six packs on the way. Maybe six after that as well. Probably six after that. Let's see what we can do. I like these though because it's just, it's just nothing but packs in a little box. It's cute, man. There we go. Shoulder. Helix Fossil. Slowpoke. Magmar, Big Air Balloon, Primeape, Fero, Arcanine, Grimer, Slami. Okay, so far, no. The hypothesis is the hypothesis is the hypothesis is wrong. Tried to say that word twice, wasn't working. Never again. Okay, Helix Fossil. Here we go. Slowpoke, Magmar, Horsey, Energy Sticker, Executor, Rhydon, Bulbasaur. Ditto. Chansey. This might be like the worst streak of packs I've had ever. Bellsprout. Come on. Magic Carp. Oddish. Mankey. War Turtle. Hypno. Polyrath. Moltres. Diglett. Oh my goodness me. We've pulled something. We've pulled a full art, but it's the same card that we pulled earlier in the video. A duplicate. Blastoise EX. Make sure you guys are subscribed in case we see a grading return of these cards, these duplicates, or check out Pokerant if we are going to put these on the store. I'll have a look at the conditions closely after and we'll, we'll pick one of the two. For goodness me. No hollow energies in a while either. I'm still gassed. Don't get me wrong. I'm gassed with the Blastoise. I'm really, I'm really gassed with that. It's a great pull. Execute. Execute. Clefairy. Bills Transfer. Pincer. Golbat. Rigid Band. Beedrill. Gyarados. At least the center is better on this little this little uh, booster collection right here. Now, Hollow Energy again. Wrap me out. Give us something in this pack, please. Execute. Clefairy. Come on. Machop. Pidgeot. Oh, that's the Pidgeot. Okay, cool. Good to know. Uncommon. Interesting. Omanite. Tauros. Dome Fossil. Oh my goodness. That's what I'm talking about, guys. A secret rare. Oh, sorry. Ultra rare gold. Psychic energy and we thought this psychic energy was on point actually, you know what? Which one do you prefer? Honestly, obviously the ultra rare is oh, Imagine they had this holofoil on the ultra rare. Oh, right, let me know in the comments. Which one's better guys? Which one do you prefer? Honestly, 
It might be the hollow one for me. And then behind that, we have a, a Dodrio. But I'm still gassed to get this. Bind a filler, you know what I'm saying? Gold car, we take the gold. They're so shiny, they're so cool. But the actual test is correct. So far, this booster collection has been better than both ETVs in this video. Interesting to say the least. Ending it off with the hollow water energy. You know, I still might open another one of these for you guys. I'm enjoying this. Machop, Porygon. Where has Porygon? I don't know. Electabuzz, Rhyhorn, Leftovers, Muk. See a reverse hollow, Persian. Reverse Hollow Pidgey. Come on. Come on. Final card. Do something amazing. Ah, Flareon Hollow. But guys, I'm going back for more. The final product of this video is going to be one final booster collection, okay? One final one. Let's go. Let's do this. 151. One final box. Six packs to go. Let's go. We've got Kakuna, Electabuzz, Coughing, Tangela, Fero, Onyx, Dragonair, Ponyta, Bellsprout Reverse and a Aerodactyl Hollow. Let's go. Come on. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling excited. That Blastoise and Gold Energy has got me a little bit giddy. I'm excited to see what's to come. Horsey, Abra, Diglett, Ooh, Giovanni's Charisma, Ride on these nuts. We've got a Rigid Band. We've got Machamp. we got a Reverse Hollow Need Arena. And then we have a Moltres Hollow. No Hollow Energy. Next pack Pidgeotto, Magmar, Shelder, Bellsprout, Graveler. Protective Goggles, Arcanine, Magnemite. Oh my gosh, an Ivysaur art rare. That's so cute, man. That is so cute. The reflection, the grass, the water, Leech Seed Vine Whip. What a great art rare. And the final card is an Articuno. This is nice though. I like the Ivysaur, man. So many more art rares to pull. I haven't got the Pikachu yet in English. I pulled that card so many times in Japan or Japanese set, but I haven't got it in English yet. I'd like to get it. So if you guys subscribe to the channel, hopefully sometime soon you'll see me pull the Pikachu Art Rare, one of the best cards from the set, in my opinion. We've got a Doduo, Tentacool, Ratatata, Squirtle. Come on, I'm feeling this box. Hitmonchan, Seeking. I'm seeking some good cards. Dugong, Polyrath, and a Chansey. Come on, not like this. End on a high, man. Let's go. Let's end on a high. Come on. Horsey, Nidoran, Abra, Diglett, Tentacruel, Snorlax, Sandslash, Geodude, Weedle, and a Vaporeon. Okay, here we are, guys. One final pack. Hashtag last pack look down in the comments, guys. Pause the video or scroll down. Write the comment. Hashtag last pack look. We can do this, guys. We can do it. We can get some fire on this final pack. Come on, come on. No hollow energy, but that's okay because we have a Voltorb to start things off. A Krabby. Next. Sandshrew. Sandshrew. Seal. Slowbro. Machoke. Come on. Dugong, I'm feeling it. The choke. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let's go, guys. Every single one of you who put hashtag last pack look down below, you did this. You brought us one of the best cards in the entire set. Look at the shine on this. Erica's Invitation, the special illustrated rare. In Japan, this is the most expensive card apart from the Master of Pikachu, which doesn't exist in the English set. But we have Erica's invitation let's go and there's more behind that potentially with a hollow needy king but guys let's go definitely this card and the charizard are the most sought after cards of the set and we've pulled the erica invitation of course let's check the quality on this one we have to make sure this is a good copy oh no look at that in the bottom right guys ah the condition on this set is a bit inconsistent i've had nice cards and i've had not some nice cards but i won't get the 10 though so probably a binder copy for me. This looks so good in, in the Ace Lab though. It really does. But there we go, guys. Erica's Invitation. Okay. Okay. All in all, actually, I will say a very good opening, to be honest. We've got the promo cards from the ETVs. We've got the Erica's Invitation, two Blastoise, the Gold Energy. I will say, funnily enough, the ETV wasn't as good as the two booster collection, little booster boxes we had, the six pack things. Make sure you go and check out my video on those if you haven't already. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you check everything in the description down below. Grading packs, whatnot. Everything's there for you guys. Thanks for watching though. Much appreciated. See you guys next time and peace.